When Lou first rang and told me that he'd nominated me for a competition on the radio, he said, how would you feel about going to Tokyo? I got a phone call on a Friday afternoon saying that we had been shortlisted. And if I got a ring either Sunday night or Monday morning, I needed to pick up that phone call. I was camping that weekend and we were gonna stay down Sunday night. I went, I can't because there's no reception. And if this phone rings, I need to answer it. Sure enough, Sunday afternoon, phone rings. I rang mum as soon as I got off the phone with uh, Jessie and Sean about making finalists and she was ecstatic. I was listening on the radio and they, they nominated the top three and Lou's name came up and I thought, oh my God. I was thrilled and overwhelmed. It started to really feel real then. Dad passed away when I was two. I have 11 older siblings and mum took it on herself to raise all of us. Mum was working a lot, but we lived right near a river and mum used to take us all marining, horse riding and spend all of our time walking through the bush with the siblings and our dogs. That was probably the most special time for all of us. She um, got into an accident on the farm with a cow. She actually got resuscitated three times, broke multiple bones in her body. She told me to ring her work and let her work know that she wasn't going to be in the next day, but she'd be in the following week. And then after that, she spent a week and a half in trauma unit in Perth. Mum constantly went above and beyond and out of her way to make sure that we all had the childhood we deserved. So we used to go on a big like family camping trip and skiing out Glen Mervyn Dam. And mum was waiting around in the water and saw what she describes as a towel floating across the current under the water, what she thought was a wet towel. And when she grabbed it, it was actually a child. And at that point, the child was unresponsive, wasn't breathing. Mum had to pull her out of the water. And yeah, as the story goes, mum ended up saving this girl's life never felt like a successful parent. We're all on our own journey. Um, if you need to take a day off to spend with your kid, whether your kid's sick or they just need you, do it. Your kids appreciate it if they know you, really know you. This trip for me has really given me a lot. It has given me the chance to relax and I love culture, I love other people's traditions and I've always read a lot about different countries. This is our first holiday together and she's just loving it at the moment. The chance to break from my day to day and the opportunity to spend time with Lou, just Lou. It's been great and great laughs and some great time together. Now you're saying this, I want you to know I nominated you because you're an absolute legend for everything you've done, our whole childhood, our whole lives, not just for your family, not just for your kids, not just for all the other children in our family, for everyone in every community around you. You go above and beyond every single time and you have composure and you won't ever take a thank you for it. So this is my thank you.